Hey, Gigi Squad, welcome back to the episode of Is It Worth It? So for today's episode, we got this cool I'm right here, and basically what this is, is a three-in-one sleeping bag. If you can see it from the brand called King Camp. So for this brand, they actually have a lot of different type of like sleeping bags available, but for the one that I got right here, it's a in one So what that means is the fact that it allows you guys to remove different layers inside. So that way, if it's like too warm, you can take off certain layers, but if it's too cold, then it's add more layers on top. So first, I'm actually open this up to show you guys what the inside looks like first. All right, so once you guys open up, this actually looks like inside. Let's take it out. All right. So once you guys take it out, and you see the product is definitely pretty big because it's not like your typical sleeping bag. This is an XXL size. But you can see when you guys do get the product, it's all nicely wrapped up. Let me actually take out the wrapper first. So you can see the size of the product is definitely pretty big, like I mentioned, since it is an XXL size. But you can see in the front, we do have the brand logo. Top part, we do have the handle for you guys to carry around really easily. And on the side, we do have the zipper for you guys to open it up. But first, I'm actually open this up to show you guys what the product looks like inside when you guys take everything out. All right, so once you guys open up the bag inside, here we have the sleeping bag. You can see how it's all nicely rolled up. And they do have a strap for you guys to unbuckle it. So let's unbuckle it first. So I do love the way how to design the buckle because it's like built in. So that way you guys don't have to worry about finding it afterward. So once you guys fully open it, here is basically what the product looks like. So you can see the size of the product is actually very big. Like I mentioned, it is XXL. But it's definitely really cool how they probably got the pillow and it also probably got the sleeping bag option right here. And if you guys are curious about what this part is for, it's basically like a windproof or wind cover. So that way you guys can hang it somewhere and protect yourself from the wind. So you can see on both sides right here, they give you guys the option to hang it somewhere if you guys want to. If you guys look carefully on the top part of both sides, they do give you guys a compartment to put stuff in here, like your cell phone, your power bank, etc. And it is pretty spacious. Same thing for the other one right here. There's two pockets for you to put stuff if you guys want to. But for this part, you do have the option to hang somewhere or leave it flat down the floor like this. But if you guys are planning to use it somewhere where it's actually really windy, you definitely want to hang that somewhere so that we can block the wind. And then right here, we do have the pillow that's provided for you guys, but you do have the option to use your own one if you guys want to. And then for the pillow, it does have a built-in zipper for you guys to zip it onto the sleeping bag, which is on the top. So it should be right here. Just put it in and then zip it up. And it's all set. So that way your pillow can't go anywhere afterward. But right here on the sleeping bag, they do give you guys different layer for you guys to unzip it. So if you guys unzip the first one, that's the first thing go. But once you guys open up, here is basically what the product looks like. So I mean, see when you guys do fully expand the product, it's definitely pretty big. So that way, if you guys want to sleep more than one person in here, you definitely can. Because for this part right here, you see how it actually opens up. So that way, if one person wants to sleep here and another person wants to sleep here, they can bring their own pillows and sleep on this side, which is kind of cool. Or like I mentioned, when it's pretty hot and you guys don't want to use any blanket, you do have the option to use the top part to actually sleep on because it basically works as a liner. But if you guys are planning to use it during like the winter season when it's much colder, you can definitely sleep inside right here or then fold it back up. And that way you guys can get double layer on here or triple layer. I believe the fabric that's on here is washable for the inner layer. I'm not too sure about the outer layer. And then for the pillow, I believe you guys can wash it as well. But mainly the inner layer, I do know that you can wash it. But I can see for each different layer or different section on here, they do have a zipper for you guys to open up. Even for the liner as well. And for the liner, it does give you guys a zipper inside and outside. So that way when you guys are sleeping inside, you guys unzip it from the inside as well, not just from the outside. But if you guys are curious about what the inner layer and outer layer looks like, here is basically actually looks like. So I'm actually hop on and test it out to show you guys what the product looks like from each different section as a three in one option. So the first option is for you guys to use a whole entire option like this. So that way if you guys want to share with friends or something, you do have the option. So let's say if I want to sleep right here, I have that option available if I want to. And I can take off the pillow and put it right here. Or if I want to sleep on that side, I can definitely do this as well. And it is pretty comfortable when I do use the pillow. Another option is for me to go inside so if I go like this, here is another option for me to use it. And the last option is for me to actually fold it up. So just like this. So that way you can get three layers on here and actually feel really warm. So the only time that I see anyone using like three layers on here is when it's actually really cold. Maybe like during the winter season or something. But during the summertime when you have to go camping or hiking, you probably don't want to put three layers. But you definitely have all the different options available to play around how you guys want to use it. Only issue that I do have with using this product is the fact that if I do sleep inside right here, 
there's not much of a cushion in the bottom because right now I am sleeping on a hard surface on the floor. So you probably want to buy like a padding or something underneath it to give you guys that cushion underneath it. And also another thing that's actually really cool about the liner option is the fact that you guys can take it out. And once you guys take it out, you do have the option to use like a blanket like this. So that way you can cover yourself if you guys want to. So you definitely have a lot of different ways for you guys to use the product, which is kind of cool. But here is basically what the product looks like once you guys fully expand it. Let me actually put a way to show you guys how to fold it up and put it away. All right, so the way how you guys put away the product is actually very simple. Let me fold it up to show you guys how to put it away. All right, so once you guys zip it all up, then you can start folding it back up. So you probably want to fold it in half. You guys want to roll it up. And you guys want to buckle it up as you guys are going. All right, so we got one down. And now we got the second one. And once you guys do buckle it up, you do have the option to tighten up right here when you guys squeeze it. Same thing for this one. And then once you guys finish that, you're gonna put it back into the bag. And then the last part on top. And it has all set. So you see the whole setup process and everything didn't take that long. But putting it away definitely takes a little bit longer because of it, see it takes some time for us to squeeze it in. But that is basically everything that's on the product. Now the unboxing and testing product. Now the end question of whether or not it's actually worth or not. So for this product, I do have to say that it's pretty worth it if you guys want to need one of these, especially if you guys are trying to look for a high quality sleeping bag where it's actually very spacious. So that way, if you guys want to sleep like two people or three people, or if you just want to use it for yourself that has multiple layers on here to keep you guys really warm during like the colder season, then I do have to say that it's pretty worth it. But then obviously with those of you guys who don't want or don't need one or have one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that you actually do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.